Although Robert Kiyosaki is most known for his book Rich Dad, Poor Dad, his business and financial advice can be found in all 25 of his books. Some people find his counsel controversial, but when it comes to the rich and poor generating money in very different ways, you can't dispute with them. Following his ideas and generating money the way the rich do provides a lot of promise and also offers the best tax benefits. Learn Robert Kiyosaki's success guidelines so you may escape the rat race and earn money the way the rich do. Welcome to Cashflow Canvas, where we teach lessons about investment and money-saving techniques. If you want to make your financial future better, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for the latest updates. Experience improves your intelligence. Kiyosaki used his credit card to make the down payment on a rental property when he initially started his real estate investing career. The cash flow was quite low due to his high level of leverage. He ended up making a big profit as a result of growing housing values in the Hawaii area, but the experience he acquired from the process was far more useful. We can read and study about business and investment indefinitely, but going through the process is where we can learn the most. The more experience you have, the better and more profitable your decisions will become over time. Take everything that comes your way, good or bad, as a learning experience that will help you succeed in the future. More is received when you give more. When Kiyosaki encounters someone who doesn't have any money, he assumes they're not providing anything. Giving is a mindset that leads to financial success, whether it's putting in extra effort at work or sharing your rewards with others. If you're not experiencing the financial success you want, it's because you're not putting in enough work in the proper locations. To achieve your desired result, you must put forth some effort. The reason most people fail is that they are unwilling to put forth the initial work required to see larger accomplishments in the future. Continue to do so. It may take some time for the hard work to pay it off. Change your way of thinking. To be successful, you must think differently than others. Before he became affluent, Kiyosaki would pay himself first before paying any of his bills. As a result, he had nothing left over to pay his responsibilities, forcing him to think outside the box in order to make ends meet. When bill collectors came after him, he saw it as motivation to increase his income through enterprises or real estate investments. The easy way to pay expenses in the short term would be to acquire a job like everyone else, but he understood that doing so would financially harm him in the long run. He didn't want to wind up in the rat race of never-ending work like his unfortunate father. Remember that if you think the same way everyone else thinks, you'll wind yourself in the same location doing the same thing. Focus. Kiyosaki feels that focusing on one item at a time is preferable to diversification. His focus acronym is follow one course until successful. When he first got into real estate, he stuck with it until he discovered out what worked and what didn't before shifting his focus to something else. Society frequently succumbs to shiny object syndrome and never sticks with one course of action until it succeeds. Moving from one new chance to the next makes it difficult to perfect. He expanded into enterprises and other sorts of investing after becoming wealthy in real estate. Following through on one item rather than hopping to new ideas every few months can sometimes be the key to success. It takes time, failure, and success to become an expert in one field. Difficulties present opportunity. Global economies cycle throughout time, but fresh opportunities emerge even during difficult times. It is up to you to keep an eye out for these and take advantage of them. When the real estate market plummeted, for example, Kiyosaki was able to buy five golf courses from a bank for a fraction of what he felt they were worth. Many individuals crumble under the weight of these uncertain times, but those who can think critically and act have enormous potential. Buying stocks as the market falls is a common example of this type of activity. However, each cycle is distinct from the others. You must always remain alert and proceed with caution. Run your business properly. Kiyosaki's initial business was a wallet manufacturer. He was successful and sold numerous wallets, but the company was always losing money since it was not administered properly. A decent product is crucial, but operating effectively accounts for a big amount of success. Examine a fast food establishment and consider whether it offers the best product at the best pricing. They most likely do not. 
but if the business is conducted well, they can still make a profit. Independent restaurants fail at an alarmingly high rate, but it's not generally because the cuisine is bad. It's usually because the proprietors don't know how to run and market a business effectively. A firm should ideally be built to generate its own funds without the need for outside funding. Understand how you make money. Income can be earned in a variety of ways, but everyone should be aware of the sort they earn. The various ways people make money have vastly varied tax ramifications. In the United States, earned income or salaries are taxed more than any other sort of income, making it an inefficient means to accumulate wealth. You work hard, which is usually the most difficult method to make money, only to give the government the lion's share of your earnings. Portfolio income, which might include profitably purchasing and selling stocks, is taxed at a lower rate, making it far superior to receiving a wage. Passive income is the finest sort of income because it comes in even if you're not actively working and is frequently not taxed at all. The tax code is designed to encourage people to earn revenue in this manner, but most people are unaware of it. Don't be afraid to fail. Most people who have achieved success have done so after numerous failures. This is widespread knowledge among the wealthy, but not so much among the poor and middle classes. They frequently fail to recognize the hardships that people must endure in order to succeed. People should not be frightened to fail because doing so often precludes them from attempting at all. Kiyosaki, like many other great business people, lost millions of dollars before succeeding. He claims that a baby learns to walk by standing and falling repeatedly until they can do it correctly. When learning to ride a bike, the same thing happens. Investing in business is no different, as you should expect to be an expert when just starting out. You can read, study, and listen all you want, but like riding a bike, you won't truly understand until you try. Don't let the fear of failure prevent you from getting started. If and when you fail, remember that others have failed before you and success is just around the corner. Instead of saving money, hedge it. Saving money is a quaint concept that has been rendered obsolete since the dollar was decoupled from the gold standard in the 1970s. This meant that the dollar's worth no longer represented an actual amount of gold. Since then, savers have been the biggest losers as the value of the dollar has been steadily undermined as banks issue more money and dilute the currency while commodity prices rise. Savings account interest nearly never keeps up with inflation, Thus, the value declines the longer it is held in cash or in a bank account. If you're lucky, the bank will pay you 1% interest, while inflation averages 2%. Instead of saving money, Kiyosaki suggests hedging it by investing in assets such as precious metals, commodities, or real estate. Their prices rise when the value of the dollar falls, and their underlying value rises as well. Robert Kiyosaki has some great advice to share. It frequently contradicts typical financial advisor's advice, which encourages clients to work, save, invest, and finally retire. But his beliefs make sense. They helped countless others realize how to make money the right way. His counsel is invaluable if you want to achieve financial independence and protect yourself from inherent economic hazards. As we conclude, I'd like to thank you for watching. I hope you found value in this video and learned something new, and I look forward to seeing you in our future videos. I would deeply value it if you could like this video and subscribe to our channel. Your support will help us to create more valuable content, and we can work together to secure your financial future. What are the key takeaways from this video that you can share in the comment section?